So Fox steps up to the tee. What a great season he's had. Two wins already, a couple more near misses. Oh, that's so bad. That's not his best, Richard Boxall. No, that's a little bit of a wide, that one has to be said there for Ryan Fox, but I'm sure he'll recover from there. Tough opening hole, 441 yards. I thought it was Ryan. I thought his ball was in next to the tree. That's a poor one, though. It wasn't a difficult shot at all. Just a wedge. Third shot there of Ryan Fox at the first hole. So work to be done, 12 feet or so, 15 feet maybe, to save his par. Here is Fox for par at the first. Not the start he was hoping for. That's not a gimme either, is it? Birdie putt here for Ryan Fox to get back to level. That's brilliant, isn't it? He was fairly wayward off the tee, but he made amends with the approach shot. And that gets him back where he started the day at level par, dropped a shot at the first, par the second, birdied number three. 52 to carry the bunker just shy of the green, but he's out with iron. Yeah, way Huge down drive, this though. hole on the right hand side here, Sam. Happy about that one. Oh, the box. Oh, not a great approach shot. He's left him a lengthy number pin in the shadows. Not easy to judge this one. with the ball above his stance here. Second shot, nice light. He's did a few of those this year. Right, Fox a birdie at nine, great second in here. Just get under par, well done. To the tenth, Ryan Fox. If he can start the back nine with a birdie. Man, he hasn't quite hit it, has he? Oh, he had it as well, right in the middle. So he stays one under, Ryan Fox. As is this man back on the tee. But only with a, a driving iron here, John. Yeah, it's such a daunting tee shot. And this is why Ryan Fox is out with the iron here. Long, slithery, thin, sneaky fairway. You've got water to the right. And well, if you've got driving you slightly, but there'll be OB on the left hand side. So this is why he's out with the iron. Try and find the fairway. He can easily get home in two, just over 535 yards. That's a beauty. It is ranked 18, easiest on the golf course. Oh, this is launched. Yeah, it looks like a good line, John. Iron, iron. 16 putts through 10 holes. How would you feel about that? Yeah, four under twos for putting. You, you, not too bad. Yeah, you take that nice and steady. And right, Fox for his eagle. Down the hill, I can see. Yeah, this is your right or left in this. Great 
great effort there from Fox. Almost turned in at the final second, but not quite. It's maybe a fraction too much pace. Looks like another long iron out. No driver, sorry. He was a fool of me, guys. I like it. He's off the right here. 12. Absolute perfection from Fox, miles up there. Yeah. Jeff Winter did make that birdies at the previous hole, so Winter moves it under par. Fox, two under, look at that. Extraordinary power released through the ball there. It's no wonder he hits at a country mile. Fox straight over it, he's lost the club in the bag. Federy one in. Got to get down. Yeah, he would be happy with that one from the middle of the fairway. It's a little awkward one. Up and over a little softer. He's at the back of this green. Going to break off his left, and it is rapid. Side of the fairway, 131 yards, a bit tough to grasp behind the ball. This has got to find these fairways. Gouging this one out, Sandarn. That was brilliant there. Ryan Fox judged it to perfection coming out of that thick rough. Really well played, he is strong. But look at that position to come into the ball. Hogan would have loved that. Right elbow kissing your right pocket. Beautiful release through the ball. Well, Fox would be happy to see what happened. That latter part of that putt, it will move off to the left hand side, so they're right to left in this. to this green he can get to the back of the ball no problem about that it's just where he's going to pitch this if he pitches it on the green it can be nice and soft might come up a bit short and that's not where you want to be short of this hole so he might go for a little bit of fringe and let it scoot down it will break off his left no, he played that magnificently so unlucky not to go in Chopped across it, held it off beautifully, hit it in low with a lot of check. It's about 311 down the right to carry the hazard and take that out of trouble. This man shouldn't have a problem with it. Oh, and Fox nearly chipped in at the last. Here we go. Okay, top tracer following the flight of that ball. Stay there. Yeah, just okay. okay. Coming out of the first cut, Fox with the grass coming in against him, 132 yards out. Not too bad from Fox here, straight at it, just four or five yards short. Well, if you hear a few bells, it's the, the sheep. Just to the left of this green, in the fence there, all in unison, looking down at Ryan Fox over an uphill putt, see if he can make his birdie. Might hear there, eh, if it goes in. Sound effects, John, I like that. Well, nice life for Fox, lucky to be through this green. It was bang on the line, obviously just caught the downslope of the fringe, just over the bunker, scooted to here. Loads of green to work with. Ball in the back of the stands, hands forward. Very nicely done by Ryan Fox. Ryan Fox was over the back of this green in two, chipped to here. Hold 
hold it, no problem. To three under par. Good season continues. Well, 106 yards from Ryan Fox and the caddy's done his pieces. Coming from way left by the hospitality. Don't worry about the out of bounds post that you see. That's on the first fairway from the ninth. You can't go down onto the first fairway. It's a nice light. Johnny, I wonder, if, I wonder if many caddies stand there and say straight over the wigwam to their player. <laughs> I know. I did ask the rules of his if it was a TOI, but no. He's done very well, hasn't he? No birdie, I'm afraid, for Ryan Fox at the last. Early long, 27th on the DP World Tour rankings. That man is third, of course. Uh, it's a 68 for the Kiwi. To watch another DP World Tour video, click here. And to subscribe, click here.